welcome back welcome back welcome back yeah hey guys so i'm here i think this is nail miss i think i think this is nail miss but this video was pre-recorded so i don't know when it's going to get uploaded but i'm pretty sure it's going to be for nail miss however let's get started so i have glued on the tips i previously um took the tips out and uh figured out which ones fit my fingers and i shaped them before i glued them down you heard me right. I shaped the tip of the nail before I glued them to my nails. Therefore, I don't have to do shaping while they're on my fingers. Um, the color that I'm using is from Glam and Glitz. Unsure of the name. The monomer I'm using is from you know, Supply Glamour. The brush I'm using is from... It's If that's a black brush, I think it's from uh, Young Nails. If it's a brown brush, I can't really see. If it's black or brown, because, you know, sometimes the colors be off. Um, If it's a brown brush, it's from iGel Beauty. So, yeah, we're going to be doing some pop art. You already know something real cute and simple. As you can see, drain it. Tame the top, tame the top, tuck it in, tuck it in, tuck it in, tuck it in. Round a cuticle, round a cuticle. Uh -huh. with your brush and bring it on down bring it on down mm -hmm. it got a little stiff because i was taking too long to fix up the cuticles i had to put another bead down just to kind of get rid of some of the lumps and bumps that i created on my own so there we go put the bead down turn the top and bring it down bring it down on the sides on the sides bring it down bring it down Yes, ma'am. Keep the shape. Keep the shape. Keep that shape, baby. So, yep, 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 yep. Clean it up. Clean it up. Take any excess off the edge. Be drain it. Bring it down. Tame the top. Tame the top. Seal it. Seal it. Seal it around the cuticles. Yes, ma'am. Yes, there's good vibes. And bring it on down. Bring it on down. Next, get to me. Next nail. Drop that bead. Tame the top. And bring it on down. Bring it on down, bring it on down, bring it on down, bring it on. Ooh, look at that. That looks horrible. It looks horrendous. It looks lumpy and bumpy. Tragic. We're just going to fix it with the drill. Tame the top, tame the top. Tame the top. Clean it up. Clean it up if you need to. With your brush and bring it on down, bring it on down. Next nail. Oh, nope. Need another bead. It did kind of look off. I ain't want to say nothing, but it did look off. I guess we're fixing it. I like that for me. Drinking our wine. We ain't gonna worry about that, though. You must be 21 years of age to drink. Remember that. Okay. Tame the top. Tame the top. Bring it on down. Bring it on down. Bring it on down. That beat was way too big. Because I'm going to take off a lot at the bottom. At least I, th I thought I was. <laughs> a lot. Okay. Whatever. But it just seemed like the beat was too big. It was thicker than the other beats. Next bead, cuticle bead. Drain it, place it down, tame the top, tame the top, tame the top, seal it, seal it, seal it, bring it on town, bring it, not bring it up town, bring it around town and bring it down. Yes, ma'am. On to the pinky. I did have to double tip because I made it too short originally, so yeah. But that's neither here nor there. Bring it on down, bring it on down. We love to see it. Yes, ma'am. Yes, we do. Mm-hmm. Next bead. Tame the top, tame the top. Bring it around. I'm sorry y'all can't see me, but y'all know the vibes already, though. So yeah. Next bead. Thicken up the uh apex. Yes, ma'am. Looks good. I don't know if I'm a cap with clear. I didn't. Great. Alright, so I'm reshaping the nail using the hand file. I mean the e file, not the hand file, e file. Bring it in, bring it in, clean up the sides, clean it up under the bottom. And then we're going to knock off all them conus that I put on there because that thing was raggedy and jank. For real, for real. So we're going to smooth it out. This is a sanding band. This is my scholar gel from Melody Susie. The sanding band is probably a 180 grit. And it's a zebra. <laughs> Here I am reshaping again, reshaping, reshaping. Getting rid of them dumps, not them dumps, them lumps and them bumps. 
Yes, ma'am. Going around town. Cleaning up the sides. Going around. When we go around the cuticle, we just cut down some of the bulk. Yes, ma'am. Get them right. Get them tight. Yes, ma'am. I'm sorry, y'all, but that was my head. I'm sorry, y'all. Yes, ma'am, yes, ma'am, yes, ma'am. All right, next nail. Sorry, I'm a little bit out of frame. That's why it's so hard for me to record me doing my own nails because I'll be all out of frame, y'all, looking crazy as crap. Crazy for no reason at all. Yes, ma'am, clean it up, clean it up. Clean it up. Smooth out the nail. It's so much easier when you're doing this on your client. But the goal is just to have smooth nails. We don't want raggedy nails. They look pretty. They look all right. This color is so, like, summertime. It's really pop art. Like, the, the color itself, it just gives, it screams pop art to me personally. So, yeah, that's why I went with it. Clean up them sides. Reshaping. Getting that free edge. Now it's time for me to smooth it all out. Smooth it out, smooth it out. I'm sorry, my head keep getting in the camera. Yes, ma'am, we're going to go around that cuticle, cut down that bulk. Yes, we are. Yes, we are, because we got to. We have no choice. We have absolutely no choice. Um, I'm talking all throughout this video because I'm editing it on my phone. And I don't have any music to input. So, y'all be mindful. Um, It's fairly quiet in my house, typically. Unless the train rides by, then it gets loud. Which I feel like it's coming. Definitely coming. But anyways, we're going to keep going. Now we're going to do the outline using black gel paint. I mean, not gel paint, gel polish. The, the polish I got is from Beatles. It's their, they had a duo set with black and white. So I grabbed that. Because y'all know I love Beatles, baby. I love that Beatles. So, yeah, we're going to outline each of the nails in black. I don't think um, I got to say too much because I'm actually showing y'all, which is crazy. Yes, my brush is bent up and raggedy and old. But that's neither here nor dear. And it's cheap. But I don't care nothing about that at all because it work. As you can see, it work as good as I needed to. As long as you're good with your like hands, it don't matter how crooked and whatever your brush is. You just kind of have to be steady with your hand and you will have control. That's the goal, just to have control over the brush. Even when you're laying acrylic, when you're painting gel polish, when you're doing line work, you just need to have control. Yes, ma'am. And then I'm going to put this in the lamp for probably 30 seconds. Cause I would be putting it in and out. Oh, I'm sorry, y'all. I'm yawning. I'm gonna be putting it in and out of the lamp for other um for white and the green highlights. So yeah. All right, center dryer. We'll do blah blah blah. How have you guys been? If you made it this far in the video, could you leave me a um? What would I like for y'all to leave me in the comments? Leave me a black heart. Y'all know that's one of my favorites. It's the black heart. So leave me a black heart. Yes, ma'am. All right, so now it's time for me to do the um last portion of the black, which is like a little uh detailing. Just adding a little bit more detail for the pop art before I do my white and my, um. what do you call it? My white and my uh other green that I'm going to be using. A lot of people use different colors and highlight this differently. I think that is so cute that everyone has been doing that. Here's my green. I probably should have used a thinner brush for this because it came out a little thick. But there's neither here nor there because it's done. It's over with. Can't worry about it. I was changing the song. Oh, excuse me. Yep. We're going to add that along the side and curve it towards the top. Add it on the side, curve it at the top, and bring it down a little bit. Mm-hmm. I really feel like I should have used a flatter brush, but we're here now. Like I said, it's done. Go around. 
Break it down, break it down, curve it at the top. Curve the top. Break it down, break it down. Yes, ma'am. It's looking so good already. And then all I gotta do is put my white on there and we done. I think I'm gonna top coat it. I think the top coat should be matte, of course. That's me on Instagram trying to see where did they put the white. Because I know it has some white in it. So, yeah, shout out to Instagram. Shout out to TikTok. Shout out to everything. There are my white and my dots. White right there. And then we're going to do two dots. Yep. White right there. And then we can go white right there. Two dots. Two dots. White. Two dots. And my white. Yes, ma'am. It's going out so good. I already know. I'm already knowing. Eh. Of course, like I said, I could have done better if I used this smaller brush to do my um, darker green lines. However, it still came out really nice. Um, once again, if you made it this far, leave me a black heart at the bottom. I think we're coming to an end. And I just want to say I really appreciate y'all. I'm at... 663 subscribers at the moment and i just want to say thank you thank you thank you thank you thank you thank you for coming and being a part of the journey for real and if you guys could just please like comment subscribe share my video um i'd really appreciate it i really would i don't know what i'm doing right now. i'm probably just like reshaping something because i tend to get like super perfecting about stuff so we doing some um matte top coat. The top coat is Beatles. It is. Um so yeah, we're gonna knock that out. Do each of these fingers. It's so cute. Look at my little pop art nails. Oh my god. Oh my god. I think this is gonna be um this is probably gonna be nail miss day one, just so I can go ahead and get it out so I don't miss the the trend. So yeah, definitely nail miss day one. And if it's not nail mist day one, I'm going to drop this before um, nail mist starts. So this may just be your announcement that I am doing nail mist. That means you will be getting one video a day until Christmas. Oh my God. And I hope you guys stay along for the journey and watch every video because, yeah, I think I'm pretty funny in these videos. Y'all be telling me I'm funny. But anyways... We gonna finish. We gonna see these when they come out the dryer, y'all. Uh, just in case you were wondering, <laughs> the wine I'm drinking is it's a Moscato wine from what brand is that? It's not Yellowtail. It might be Yellowtail. Hmm. I don't know, but it's really good. Um, my favorite uh, Moscato is from Woodbridge, but I've only ever found that in South Carolina, so. That sucks. Woodbridge Moscato tastes so good. There you go. It's matte. It's cute. We're going to put some cuticle oil on it. I think. Because them cuticles look dry in a bitch. Oh, yep. Okay, good. Because they were dry. They look raggedy. All right. There we go. It looks so good. 